Atlanta, Georgia, WGCL, several Atlanta police officers have reportedly walked off the job at precincts across the city. The claim comes hours after charges were filed against ex-officer Garrett Rolfe and officer Devin Brosnan in the Rayshard Brooks's case. The buzz of patrol officers staging walkouts and refusing to answer calls from precincts 3, 5, 6 and others began circulating social Wednesday evening. CBS 46 confirmed the walkout through sources at 8.30 p.m. APD attempted to quiet the noise of a walkout by tweeting, On CNN Wednesday evening, Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms addressed the evolving situation surrounding the police department. There's a lot happening in our cities and our police officers are receiving the brunt of it, quite frankly, Mayor Bottoms told CNN's Chris Cuomo. She said the city has committed to the officers through a big pay raise, and, we expect that our officers will keep their commitment to our communities. She said she thinks morale is down tenfold. We do have enough officers to cover us through the night, she said. Our streets won't be any less safe because of the number of officers who called out. The mayor didn't say how many officers called out. Outside of Atlanta City Jail thousands of protesters staged a sleep-in, many calling for police reform and justice for Brooks. The 27-year-old father was killed June 13 in the parking lot of a southwest Atlanta Wendy's. Former officer Rolf is charged with murder along with 10 other charges, his partner, officer Brosnan faces three charges including assault. The first charge is felony murder. This is a death that is a result of an underlying felony and in this case the underlying felony is aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. And the possible sentences for a felony murder conviction would be life without parole or the death penalty, said Fulton County District Attorney Paul Howard during a Wednesday press conference addressing the charges. Copyright 2020 WGCL. All rights reserved.